this is our forever home now um, so it was really really important that we got the right uh, company to do the job um, and we had a few companies quote because we're obviously really careful like that um, some of them came along didn't even bother quoting and um, others came and wrote the estimate on the back of a fag packet almost um, Tony was the only one who provided a full detailed estimate of exactly what the project was going to cost us. I also feel it's important to see other, um, other clients work um, and Tony was really happy to provide um, details of other clients of his that we could go and visit, see his work, ask the cu customers questions um, and we actually did visit two properties and we were really really uh, happy with what we saw. As our work was so major and we only had one room unaffected, we were going to live in that one room that was unaffected but Tony actually uh, persuaded that we were, us that we may be better to move out. Uh, I'm very, very glad he did that um, because I, I'm not sure that we could have lived here during the build, it was so major. Um, but Tony actually went the extra mile by helping us find a local rental property um, and um, it, he then provided a timeline for our project. Um, so that we knew that we would be it would be completed within six months so we hired the rental property for six months and it actually did come in on, um, on time in fact it was a week early so we were able to move in here with a week to spare on the rental property so that was that was great news as is probably usual with a project of this size um, we decided on um, having extra things as the project went along um, such as cr um, creating a feature box in the kitchen um, above above a, um, a, my kitchen unit and in the bedroom. Um, we, we incorporated various storage items such as a cupboard under the stairs and in our eaves. Um, these were all costed in advance as extras um, but conversely to that we actually did make savings during the project because we actually um, as the project developed we decided that we didn't need certain items like originally um, Tony had costed for underfloor heating on a section of the floor that couldn't have the traditional gas underfloor heating and um, we had um, electric costed in and then we decided we didn't need that and that was a cost saving um, so everything that we did extra was usually offset by the savings and that was all given to us as variation pro of, pro of costings um, by Tony. It was also very important to us to have the freedom to choose our own items as we went along such as our kitchen, our bathroom fittings and Tony was very happy for us to do that. Um, we had our own um, kitchen, we chose our own kitchen units, had our own kitchen fitter. Um, Tony did give us ideas of where we could source our bathroom fittings and we were and was happy for us to go along, source those fittings and pay directly with the supplier which we did do. Um, but we used Tony's, um, Tony's trades where we needed to, for example we used his plumber to fit in all the bathroom um, and things like that. So um, it, it's great that he has the flexibility, um, first choice extensions give you the flexibility to be able to um, dip it in and out of what, what you want to do. Um, we also needed a tiler to tile all up, up the floor that you can see here and into the, into the hallway. Um, and Tony was happy to um, let us use his tiler to do, to do all of that for us. With regard to site um, security and tidiness, um, there was a lock up on site um, to store any valuables at first when um, the, the house was exposed to the elements. Um, with regard to tidiness, if I had any criticism of first choice extensions, I'd say that the, the site wasn't always left as tidy as it could have been overnight, um, but I am assured that that has been addressed now. The build, as I've said al already, the build was delivered on time and to budget. Um, the only variation to the budget were those requested by us uh, that had been previously um, quoted by, by the team. Um, all Tony's trades, I, I cannot fault any of them. Um, I built up, uh, I was visiting the, the site daily 
um, and I built up a rapport with the team um, and um, there's not one of the trades that I was unhappy with and got on really, really well with all of them. I think one of the things that sets um, First Choice Extensions uh, apart from the others is the social media side of things. Um, I know since we had our build um, two years ago, Tony and the team have worked really, really hard on the social media side, um, producing 360 degree tours. We've had one of our build um, that can be seen on the website. Um, also projects in progress from start to finish, so photographs on Instagram and his website, um, and then finished results. Um, so that wasn't actually in place when we had our build and I think it would, be, would have been so useful um, and it's great to see that's in place now. Thanks to all the team of First Choice Extensions, we are now living in the house of our dreams. We absolutely love living here. Um, we've moved um, from a sort of built up estate into a village. We're loving the village feel and we're, we're living in our forever home. And uh, if any of you are thinking about doing an extension um, or a project, please don't hesitate to use First Choice Extensions.